Hi, this is Wendy Stump Hi. with StreetPainting.tv and I'm speaking with Bruno Fabriano today. Hi Bruno, how Hi. are you? Hi, fine thanks. Bruno, where do you live? I live uh, in Villa Franca di Verona from Italy. And what is your occupation? I am an expert uh, of air traffic control but uh, not control. Okay, and Bruno let me ask you how many years have you been street painting? Uh, about uh, 11 years. And how did you get interested in street painting? I was uh, interested in observing a Madonna in my group in Italy. Uh, I wanted to try it. Okay. And how many paintings do you make a year? About uh, a ten. Ten. That's, that's yes. good, uh, quite a few. Um, Bruno, what countries have you street painted in? Uh, in Italy and uh, in Santa Barbara two years ago. In Santa Barbara, California. Cal California, yes. Yeah. And Bruno, let me ask if you have a favorite subject in your street paintings. I prefer uh, to draw a uh, figurative work. And how do you choose your image or your subject for the festival? I have chosen uh, this work because uh, it represents uh, the great Italian Baroque, so expressed by the meaning. Let me get out to the artist of this piece is Bernadette. Okay, and what is the name of this street painting? Uh, the, the Ecstasy of Holy Teresa. Okay, the Ecstasy of Holy Teresa. And what inspired you in your image choice? How did you choose this image? Uh, the witness and um, and the sexuality expressed uh, in, in you all. Yeah. Um, what will the finished size be and how long will it take you to make the street painting? Oh, the work will be uh, right around uh, 9 feet for 9 feet. Uh, the runtime will be uh, 16 hours. 16 hours, that's a long time to work on Oh, yes. And also, Bruno, um, what is your approach to starting your street painting? Like, how, how do you start? Do you use an original sketch or a photo? I begin with the original photo. Okay, and the photo's behind you. Yes. And um, how do you transfer a small image onto a big square? As, uh, I transfer it um, through the, the grid. I use the grid. Okay. And how do you decide where to start? Do you start at the top or do you start at the middle? I decide, uh, always decide on the top. On the top and work down? Yeah. Yes. Um, how do you how do you apply the color? Again, uh, and, uh, for my figure, uh, the orange uh, incarnate fund for the figure, only the, the figure color. So generally, you put a, an orange base color down for the skin um, for most of your pieces, but this piece is black and white, so it's different. Yeah. So it's different. Right here, this one. And what tools do you use when you are working? Uh, I use the color the three uh, thread for the grid with the uh, uh, climb mines. Which is uh, the sketching in white. You sketch out the piece in white. Yeah. And Bruno, let me ask you if you have any tips or techniques to share with us. No, I, I don't. But uh, I've come come here for learning them from from you. Okay. <laughs> yeah. And Bruno, let me ask you, what is the most difficult aspect of street painting for you? Uh, certainly in the art work and uh, to try to show the best of uh, this art uh, of the people. Do you enjoy most about street painting? Uh, the pleasure to be in the middle of the people, to let uh, but the people to participate, especially the child. And do you normally uh, work alone or do you work with other artists? Normally alone, but I would like to work uh, in a team. How do you feel about the ephemeral quality of the art form? The message to be given us to be immediate, then everything if I this way. What do you like best about the Street Painting Festival atmosphere? Uh, to be together with the Sermani Street uh, artists. It's very nice to see <laughs> It's a very nice. Work. How do American festivals differ from Italian festivals? Uh, your work uh, are great and spectacular. In Italy, the tradition of the sacred work uh, performance is uh, predominant. So in Italy, people do the sacred work, religious yeah, the sacred work, work, and here it's very different. Yes, very how do American audiences vary from Italian audiences? Is there oh, any difference? There is no difference. And 
can you share um, something funny, maybe the funniest thing that happened to you, um, or something that someone has said while you've been street painting? Oh, uh, one time a child uh, asked if I were in punishment, considering the, uh, that I was say uh, kneeling. Kneeling the whole time. <laughs> so they yes, were being the child That's asked. Very funny. Yeah. What is your favorite street painting that you have worked on to date? Oh, the Pietà of Michelangelo. It's a beautiful piece. It's a beautiful. Nice. It's my preference. And um, what would you like the public to take away from seeing your street painting? What uh, the my message uh, remains uh, in the memory. That's beautiful. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Bruno, thank you very much for your interview today on streetpainting.tv. Your piece looks great. Yes, thank you.